We want you. We are here in the Holiday Inn Ballroom of Sheridan, Wyoming. Queen Elizabeth has been here, and Kenny Rogers has been here. But tonight, we have all in the same room. Ray Parker Jr., who has joined us this evening, Emmanuel Soleil, Jerome Benton, Sheila E., Lisa Barber, me, Martha Quinn, Kristen Scott Thomas. Now, Emmanuel, would you tell Jerome how you got involved in the movie? In the movie? Well, are you ready for a fairy tale? Well, I was modeling in New York for a year when a good friend of mine told me that he heard on MTV Music News that Prince was going to do a feature film in France. So I had this vague idea, maybe I should. I could get into it. So he convinced me to call up MTV and, oh my God, so much noise. To, to call up MTV and try to get into it. So I called, I called them up and I spoke to Michael Shore. He gave me um, Prince's n number, uh, the manager's number. So I called them up and then I wrote them a letter. I sent them some pictures of myself. And a few months later, I was in Paris having dinner with Prince. And I had a part in the movie. I can't believe it. I can. Have you ever met this Michael Shore? I never get a chance to. I only speak to him on the phone. Well, Emmanuel Soleil, this is your life. Here he is, the man in question. Michael Shore. The man responsible for Emmanuel Soleil's career. Well, partially, anyway. Now, American career. No problem. My pleasure to do this. Folks, Emmanuel, good luck. I can't believe this really happened for this girl myself. Now, Michael, you yes. work for the MTV News Department. What's the say, story? I'm going to say, I just uncovered a scoop backstage. We've been thinking that Prince might be playing tonight. I have it on very, very, very good word. He is definitely going to play later tonight, live on this stage back here. So stick around. Let's take a look at Emmanuel Soleil in the movie Under the Cherry Moon in the part that Michael Shore Known as the Paisley her. Cowboy. Yeah. Near mirror, 17 fold. Who's the sexiest? Dressed in gold. You must be talking about me, Clayton. He onto the street, huh? Yeah, that, yeah, yeah, there. Perhaps Madame would like to conduct the search. Hmm. I wonder where that came from.
We're here live in front of the banjo bar. And while Maserati's playing, we're going to go in the bar and see who's in here. Follow me. Quickly. Slowly. Quickly. Women. <laughs> How are you ladies doing tonight? Great, great, great. Can I sit here and move your drink so I won't spill it all over your lap? How you doing, Mom? <laughs> what do you want me to say? <laughs> so, how'd you like the movie? It was great. You? Fabulous. Great. Excellent. Great. Fantastic. Great. 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 What else? Um, well, what was your I don't know. Scene in the movie? <laughs> um, no, I can't say that. Be too embarrassed. I don't care. Say anything as long as you like it. The love scenes. Ooh. <laughs> Who liked the love scenes? <laughs> I thought the movie was fabulous. What did you like? I loved Prince. She loved Prince. Yeah. <laughs> Who liked me? Yeah. <laughs> Let's go to the party. Come on. Hi, I'm Bob King. And I'm Bruce King. We're here at King's Hattery in Sheridan, Wyoming. And we'd like to welcome Prince to Sheridan with a big hat. What size do you think he'll take? About a seven. Yeah. I think that'd work. <laughs>